Six students across the country sat part one of the primary school examinations earlier today. A little over 7,000 boys and girls are being evaluated for proficiency in English and science. The annual testing precedes their entry to secondary school. Leticia Gomez busted in her students from La Democracia to sit the exams at E.P. York High School. I had 16 students, 5 girls and 11 boys taking the exam for today. No, I'm thinking in terms of having 16 students, you have different strengths and weaknesses and what have you. What's your confidence in their overall performance? Well, I believe with the grace of God, they will do better than what they do when they, when they did the mock exam. So I believe they'll do because sometimes it's just the threat of the exam and having getting them to prepare. And when they come and they actually sit and take the exam, they give a different feeling towards it. Preparations, according to several participants, involved extra hours of tutoring and studying. My studying well, it was intense and it took a while, so I hope, hopefully I got a really good grade on it. In terms of the questions that were asked in either the English or the science exams, did you find any of them to be uh, difficult or, or questions that were not necessarily what you prepared for? No, I prepared for everything, so I'm pretty confident about the grade I'm going to get. Hopefully over 90. This year, the number of males sitting the PSC are a little more than their female counterparts. That figure fluctuates on a yearly basis. Today, the first sitting of this year's uh, PSC, the primary school examination, uh, where the, children's, uh, the children sat um, in language arts, and which we call the English paper, and the science paper. Um, a total of 7,343 candidates were registered to take the exam today. Um, the exact numbers who sat, we'll, we'll probably know sometime later tonight. Is this a step up from the number who have sat previous exams? Um, I think very small increase, if it's between 25 and 50 at most. Somehow it's like it's, it's leveling off. We used to have some big jumps from year to year, but I, um, it's and at most a, a small increase, I would expect, smaller. Are there any trends this time around in terms of maybe the number of uh, female students as opposed to the number of male students who are sitting the exams? Um, it fluctuates every year. This year there seems to be more males than females. In fact, the actual break room is 3,657 females. Um, and a small, um, well, not big, big um, difference, but um, 3,686 males. And then one year, next year, it might be a little more male, females than males, but relatively balanced overall. Moises Florian, who attends Central Christian School, is confident in his overall performance today since he has been preparing tirelessly for the first leg of the assessment. Like the conjunctions and those stops, I wasn't prepared because I didn't study a lot of that. And I studied my letters. I am I'm, I'm sure that I passed my letters in the high scores. What about the science exam? Were you prepared properly for that? Yeah, I was very prepared for that. I studied a lot in science because I love it. In terms of your overall performance in this part of the PSC, do you think you'll do well? Yeah, I'll do great because my, bro, my brother um, did great too, 85.5. He's going APR. Now, were you able to get extra classes, maybe like Saturday classes, or you stay back after school to prepare yourself? Yeah, uh, we had morning class, afternoon class, and evening class, and Saturday class too. Reporting for News 5, I am Isana Kayetano.